day three. We're up, we're ready, we're dressed, and we're gonna go out. We're gonna get some breakfast. Um, we have got minor, we've had some editing issues and battery issues. We have one, what are they called? Adapters for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven things that we need to charge. <laughs> so we've been taking it in turns. So I don't know how long my battery's gonna last on my camera today, but I'll film as much as I can. Um, but we're gonna go out and about. We're on the sex and the sex. <laughs> no, I'll try again. We're on the sex and the city tour this morning. We're gonna meet them at the plaza at um, half 10 or 11. And then um, we're gonna go and get on the bus to uh, Ground Zero this afternoon. So that I'm quite looking forward to, but I'm mega excited for the um, Sex and the City tour. Obviously completely different things. Um, so we're, um, we have internet, we're a bit more back to civilization. We're gonna go and have a great day. Um, we kind of look half sensible, I hope. And um, there's Lauren, can say hi? Hi. Don't you look hot today? Do I? I'm back. Hope you're in New York, bro. Anyway, so um, come along with us. We're gonna go and get ready, get coats on, go for another day in New York. I hope it doesn't rain today, it looks a little bit darker. Oh no, there's blue sky. There's blue sky, don't panic. We'll see you later. So we are in, where are we? Which bit is this? Down, we're, I think we're in some bit of the village. And we're outside the pleasure chest, which is where on Sex and City, where Charlotte buys her rabbit and then gets a deal to it. Um, but we just, I just wanted to show this because we found the Freedom Building that they've built. It's all down there. It's We're in Aidan and Steve's bar, which is called O'Neill's. She's wicked. Hello. Um, we're back in the hotel. We've had quite a day. Uh, we've had quite a day. We had the Sex and the City tour this morning, which I showed you a little bit of, but we weren't allowed to film any of the stuff on the bus, any of the women's speech, which she called Spiel. <laughs> Um, or any uh, like some of the places we went inside but I uh, managed to film a bit in O'Neill's which was AS Aiden and Steve's bar so that was so cool because we were taken in there and we had a Cosmo and um, which was actually lush I've had a Cosmo before and it was really sweet I didn't like it at all um, but it was really really nice I actually found it quite yummy and I'd have one again like a proper made American Cosmo um, so uh, we had that and then we went to, we saw the library, we saw like the public library where she went in her dress, we went to, where else did we go? Oh, her obviously her stairs, like where her house is supposed to be, but she, obviously she just sort of, she said like they, they would never go in the building because people actually live there, but it was, they had like, what, like roadworks or like construction or whatever going on there and there was a great big skip right in front of the steps, oh, for God's sake. But we still got pictures of it and pictures in front of it and whatever, so um, we just couldn't go on them. And uh, then where did we go? Oh, it's been raining all afternoon and we got pretty lost, lost in New York. And um, I got us out of it. I was so proud of myself. I was like, right, we are here and we need to go there. We are on so-and-so street. I think we were on like 43rd or something like that. I don't know, um, on Lexington. And we needed to get to 45th and Madison. So, um, I figured it out on the map and I just was like right this way then that way and, da, da, da. and I felt so proud of myself because I feel like I'm finally understanding like the way of New York which is way cool I can totally see why they do it the way they do anyway so we had reservations for Buddha Khan tonight but we are not going to make it because we had a rainy horrible afternoon walking around New York trying to find things and do things and it just seemed to take forever it was really busy as well we, we weren't ended up in Times Square again and it was heaving I think it was probably like four or five o'clock so it was kicking out time and everybody was trying to do their thing anyway so we came back to the hotel because our feet were killing us we were wet and cold and bothered and tired and now we're starving so we're just finishing up some editing and I'm obviously vlogging because I haven't done any of it today really bad and uh, we're gonna go and find some dinner somewhere else we had the concierge uh, cancel our booking we're quite good we're not gonna make it there but we did go to Budokan today um, 
on the tour because obviously Sex and the City film there. So we've kind of seen it, kind of. Um, we might make it next time we're in New York if we come again. Um, I'm really bunged up. All this inside air <coughs> is... I've been like it since the plane, all the... the you know, like the... I'm waving a toothbrush thing around. Um, all of the... Uh, you know, the crappy inside air, it's not fresh and clean. So every time I'm in here for like more than an hour, my nose, I just go, ugh, it's horrible. Anyway, so I don't know where we're going to go for dinner. I don't know if I'm going to vlog anymore, but I'll try. Um, and um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Lauren's vlog today will be better than mine because I'm a bit crap today. I do apologise. Just the way it is. Deal with it. Or don't. Whatever.